Operation Cottage was a tactical maneuver which completed the Aleutian Islands campaign. On August 15, 1943, Allied military forces landed on Kiska Island, which had been occupied by Japanese forces since June 1942. The Japanese, however, had secretly abandoned the island two weeks prior, and so the Allied landings were unopposed. Allied forces suffered over 313 casualties in total during the operation, due to stray Japanese mines, friendly fire incidents, and battlefield combat. Topic. Background The Japanese under Captain Takeji Ono had landed on Kiska at approximately 1 o'clock on June 7, 1942, with a force of about 500 Japanese Marines. Soon after arrival, they stormed an American weather station, where they killed two and captured eight United States Navy officers. The captured officers were sent to Japan as prisoners of war. Another 2,000 Japanese troops arrived, landing in Kiska Harbor. At this time, Rear Admiral Manzo Akiyama headed the force on Kiska. In December 1942, additional anti-aircraft units, engineers, and a negligible number of reinforcement infantry arrived on the island. In the spring of 1943, control was transferred to Kiichiro Higuchi. Topic. Invasion plan and execution A consolidated B-24 Liberator aircraft sighted Japanese ships in Kiska. No further identification was visible. To United States naval planners, none was necessary and the orders to invade Kiska soon followed. Due to the heavy casualties suffered at Attu Island, planners were expecting another costly operation. The Japanese tactical planners had, however, realized the isolated island was no longer defensible and planned for an evacuation. Although small, there were signs of Japanese withdrawal. Anti-aircraft guns, active during the bombardment of Kiska, did not fire when Allied planes flew over in the days leading up to the invasion. On August 15, 1943, the 7th Division US and the 13th Infantry Brigade Canada landed on opposite shores of Kiska. Both US and Canadian forces mistook each other, and sporadic friendly fire incidents occurred. Progress was also hampered by mines, timed bombs, accidental ammunition detonations, vehicle accidents and booby traps, which had left 28 Americans and 4 Canadians dead, with 50 wounded on either side. A stray Japanese mine also caused the USS Abner Reed DD-526 to lose a large chunk of its stern. The blast killed 71 and wounded 47. Topic. See also. Operation Chronicle, a similar amphibious assault on an abandoned island Yank Levy, who trained many of these forces in guerrilla warfare Topic. Notes Topic. References Feinberg, Leonard Where the Willowa Blows – The Aleutian Islands World War II Pilgrim's Process, Inc. ISBN 0-9710609-8-3. Garfield, Brian The Thousand Mile War, Orem Press, 1995 ISBN 1-84513-019-7. Goldstein, Donald M., Catherine V. Dillon, 1992. The Willowa War, The Arkansas National Guard in the Aleutians in World War. Fayetteville, Arkansas, USA, University of Arkansas Press. ISBN 1-55728-242-0. Morrison, Samuel Elliott, 2001, 1951. Aleutians, Gilberts and Marshalls, June 1942 to April 1944, Volume 7 of History of United States Naval Operations in World War II. Champaign, Illinois, U.S., University of Illinois Press. ISBN 0-316-58305-7. Perez, Galen Roger 2003. Stepping Stones to Nowhere, The Aleutian Islands, Alaska, and American Military Strategy, 1867-1945. Vancouver, British Columbia, University of British Columbia Press. ISBN 1-59114-836-7. External links 
Logistics Problems on Attu by Robert E. Burks. Operation Cottage at Canadian Soldiers. Com Aleutian Islands Chronology Aleutian Islands War Red White Black and Blue, feature documentary about the Battle of Attu in the Aleutians during World War II Soldiers of the 184th Infantry, 7th ID in the Pacific, 1943-1945 World War II Campaign Brochure for Aleutian Islands from the United States Army Center of Military History. Kiska. Retrieved of March 2018. A film clip allies take Kiska etc. 1943 is available at the Internet Archive.